I have something to tell y'all today, okay? So, today I was on the bus. I was just sitting there, um, just in the bus, you know, like, listening to my music and everything with my little shades on, because it was, so, it's, um, you know, the sun is on and everything here in California, and it's, like, really, like, really sunny, and I don't want to get my eyes damaged or anything, so that's why I put my glasses on. So I was there, and then, um, I was like, okay, this busted man comes in, he sits down, and then he puts his busted little... Gilson's bags that he opened it and it smelled like two baby raccoons had snuck in there from their mama because they were running away because they didn't want to eat their peas and they died in there like three years ago because that smelled busted, crusted, and rusted. Thank you very much, sir. And then he has the nerve. Okay, so I'm just sitting there listening to music so I can't really hear to uh, like what my surroundings and everything. And I hear disgusting and homosexual. Hold a train. Hold a train. I take them off, and I know that he's talking about me. He's like, look at this homosexual kid sitting here. It's disgusting. You have drugs in your heart. Okay, first of all, Buster, sir. I have not, I had to keep in mind, I had not said a word to him. And then he just comes up to me and tells me this. What is your problem, sir? First of all, he looked like a busted homeless. He wasn't homeless, but you know, he it, it smelled, he smelled bad. He He's probably like in his 60, 65. He was busted. Busted. He has the definition of busted. You look in the dictionary uh, under the word busted. His picture is in there. His mug is in there because it's disgusting, busted, and crusted. So, and I was like, I took them off and I was like, huh? And I, I'm, I don't like to confront people like about stuff, so I let it go. But in my head, I was beating him up. I, I was beating him up. I ripped his beard off. I ripped his face off. I was giving it to the alligators. I was reading him down everything in the dictionary, honey, boo-boo, child. And then he goes to the back of me. And then he's like, um, I'm kind of scared because he goes to the back of me. He leaves his um, bags in the front of me. And then he goes to the back of me. And I'm like, oh, snap. He's going to pull out a gun, a knife, and shank me from the back. So I was like keeping my guard on, you know. And But he just got off. And I was like... If he had told me one more thing, I would have probably told him something because, uh, excuse me, sir, I don't know you. I've never seen your busted mug in my whole life. And you come up to me out of nowhere and tell me, oh, look at this ho disgusting homosexual kid. You have a lot of drugs in your heart. And he's like, where'd you get all that dope from, from your school? And I was like, excuse me? Um, I don't do drugs. If anything, you do drugs because you smell like what drugs poop. Um, you look... Like, you need to go back to the gutter, honey boo-boo, and fix yourself and get yourself together. Don't come for people when you are looking busted and crusted, and you are, it's just a mess. So, bless his heart, and, um, you know, continue with your life, y'all. I'll see you guys later then. Bye.